Now, here's your pinpoint weather forecast with meteorologist Henry Grom. Well, we've been talking about warmer temperatures throughout the week, and that's been playing a role in making our mornings a tad bit warmer. And that is still the case as we start off your Thursday with temperatures seen around the mid 50s. We still have a few spots in the upper 40s, but it's not as chilly as earlier this week. So you may not need the long sleeves to start off the day because then later on we still quickly warm up thanks to all of that sunshine. So by noon we should be back into those lower 80s with that low humidity still around and then increasing cloud cover into the afternoon. So that means we're not going to see highs later on today that high compared to yesterday where we saw some areas into the low 90s. But where is all that cloud cover coming from? Well, we have been talking about high pressure giving us all those clear skies, but of course, down towards the south, we do have tropical storm Francine bringing in all of that rain across Alabama, Mississippi, and even parts of Georgia this morning. That is going to continue to move up towards the north right now. Still a tropical storm, but a weak one at that. As it gets into Friday and the weekend, it is going to quickly diminish as it interacts with plenty of dry air. How does that play for us going into the next couple of days? Well, unfortunately, that means we're not going to see much in the way of any rain. So we'll see that increase in cloud cover this afternoon and heading into tonight. And then you see some of those showers off to our west. Well, we won't see much of that. That quickly diminishes thanks to all of that dry air. And then we get into your Saturday and that cloud cover fades away as well. So we'll be back to mostly sunny skies into Saturday and Sunday, which is not going to be very helpful for us with this ongoing drought. And a reminder, we do get another update today, this morning at around 8.30, 9 o'clock. So today we'll see temperatures not as hot, only into the mid to upper 80s. And then heading into tonight, we'll dip back down into the upper 50s with some low 60s sneaking around with partly cloudy skies. But your Friday will be mostly cloudy as we sit around those mid 80s, still staying on the dry side. But as we look at your seven day forecast, there is some shower chances on the horizon, but we won't get to see that until the middle of next week when temperatures dip back down into the low to mid 80s. Now, time to take a look at sports break.